The seventh step of molding is releasing the finished part. The same release techniques are used when releasing the part from the mold as when releasing the mold from the plug. Care must be taken when prying to avoid damaging the part as well as the mold. After the cowl is released, Dennis inspects the surface looking for imperfections which might require repair, such as air bubbles. The PVA leaves a green color which must be washed off. He sands off the excess seam flesh and then trims the final part. The finished cowling is ready for painting and installation into the model airplane. This fiberglass cowling is identical to the one taken from the kit, except that it is considerably stronger and amazingly light for the strength. The techniques you have seen in this video apply to large molds as well as small. The only significant difference in constructing a bathtub or an airplane wing is in the selection of the reinforcement. There are many different molding techniques. The one we have shown you is a reliable way to approach your first project. Most people will modify and adjust the materials and methods until they find their favorite combinations for their application. The process of molding seems complicated at first, but a little practice is all it takes to be able to make things you have never been able to make before. Remember that we are always willing to help answer your questions and help you select your materials. Good luck on your project and thanks for watching.